Now we're going to discuss three ratios that measure a company's ability to pay long-term debt. The debt ratio, debt to equity ratio, and the times interest earned ratio. First one is the debt ratio. So the formula for the debt ratio is total liabilities divided by total assets. So it's going to, it's going to show you the percentage of assets that are financed with debt. Obviously, a lower number is better. Higher number is going to represent higher risk. So if you get a debt ratio of 0.5, that means 50% of the assets are financed with debt, and the other half is financed by the owners of the business. Another way of saying that is half the assets would be owned by the owners, and half of the assets are owned by others, such as creditors that gave the company a loan. A debt ratio of 1 means 100% of all the assets are financed by debt. The next one that looks at the company's ability to pay long-term debt is called the debt to equity ratio. So this is just simply total liabilities divided by total equity. So it's showing you the proportion of liabilities relative to equity. In other words, it's measuring financial leverage. If it's greater than one, the company is financing more assets with debt than with equity. A higher number obviously means more financial risk.